Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to turn on 120fps on the Xbox Series S. So you just want to open up settings, and once you're in settings, you want to navigate to general, and then TV and display options. Once you're here, you're going to see setup, and you're going to see TV details, uh, or 4K TV details. You just want to click on this one, and you see it playing games, you will have the option of whether or not you can play 120fps or not. So you can see playing games, your TV setup doesn't support 120Hz, games won't display at 120fps. If you get this error, there are two reasons why this happens. Number one, your TV screen or your monitor screen is not 120Hz. When this happens, what this means is even if you were to theoretically play at 120fps, because your TV screen is 60Hz, only every other frame will be captured on the TV and 120 divided by 2 is 60 FPS so the max you'll be able to see is 60 FPS therefore playing 120 Hertz uh playing 120 FPS will not make a difference because your TV is capped at 60. However another thing to note is what if your TV actually supports 120 Hertz and you get this error. So if you do uh, have a TV which supports 120 hertz, like I do personally. What this means is your HDMI output does not support 120 hertz. So there's a couple of troubleshooting to do. The first one would be let's say you have the Xbox Series S right here. You want to make sure you use the same HDMI cable which comes with the Xbox Series S console. This HDMI cable supports 120 FPS. So if you are having the error like me, you just want to switch to that cable. However, if you use that cable and you're still getting this issue, that means that your TV may not support HDMI 120 FPS. However, it may support other methods such as display port 120 FPS. So what you need to do, what I would need to do personally, if I want to play 120 FPS and keeping it real, I don't want to be that guy, but I kind of prefer playing games at higher graphics at 60 FPS compared to 120 FPS, just you know, keeping it real here. What you will need to do is you will need to get a HDMI to display port adapter and with that adapter, you want to plug in, uh, you know, the other side of the port inside of the display port area of your TV. So instead of plugging in the HDMI, inside of HDMI, get an adapter which converts HDMI to display port and then plug in to the display port. And then that should solve the issue if you do have 120 FPS. However, uh, you're going to see here your TV setup doesn't support it. Once you've done that, you're going to be good to go. And once that, uh, you know, shows here, your TV supports 120 FPS, what you're going to do is you just want to open up the game of choice. And if the game supports 120 FPS, it's going to automatically work. Now, some games inside the settings, if you don't see 120 FPS, they'll have the option between performance, which is, you know, I mean, it says in the name, high frame rate, or graphics. If you have like that option, you just want to make sure you set it to performance or 120 FPS, and that will have uh, 420 FPS support.